guys, Fairly here and today we are back on the in the end server. So today's episode we're going to be fighting the end, the end dragon. And I think this might be the last episode for this series. I'm not sure I'll continue it or not or just start fresh on a server. Because I have found a server that I do really want to record on. And I have an idea for a base on there which I have all planned out and stuff. And it's not going to be messy like this one where it's just stuff scattered around. It's actually one tight together base. <laughs> Because with this one, I did have a plan of tying everything together, but it just hasn't really happened. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to show you guys what I've done since the last time, which isn't a whole lot. I haven't done anything with the villagers, and I did actually lose the villagers. We don't have any villagers in here. Well, a villager in here. I forgot to light it up, so a zombie spawned and then killed a the villager, I'm guessing. I haven't, I still have the villagers over there, but all I've been doing is just preparing for the end battle and I have actually done the skeleton farm. So we've done these, no skeleton, no, you don't do that, but what I've elevators in here, that's the wrong one, it's this one, <laughs> so we've got water elevators down here and I've redone all of this. So we've got storage over here, which is bones, arrows, and then just like bows and armor. Cast did the sorting system for me. And we did try and do a redstone, but the design that we were doing didn't work. So I did a different design, which if I just get back here, I'll show you guys that line's just for the hoppers, just for the storage system. Hopefully I'm not breaking any of the redstone back here but I just did a hot bar timer which has 19 items in it just a piston which pushes this block out to suffocate the skeletons redstone from the button Oops. and then we just have a dropper and a dropper which is just a dropper timer two observers and then just the the um I forgot what these are called. The... what am I looking at? Compara! That's the one! <laughs> I forgot what they were called there. But yeah, it's just that and then... Just a very simple one. So you just press this button, block comes out, they get suffocated. But sometimes they do die, sometimes they don't. So it's a bit weird on the timing. So it is meant to get them at half a heart, which I did change it to be two hearts but sometimes they just don't die that that skeleton with the armor on was in the, in the crusher but it didn't really work so sometimes they, sometimes they die sometimes they don't it's really weird so i don't know if they've changed like mob suffocation or anything like how much damage they take but sometimes they take too much damage and sometimes they don't take enough oh this chest here this is just a trash chest, so any unwanted items we can just put in there and it just drops them into lava. We have enchanting area just over here and that's just a chest for lapis. But other than that, that is everything on the skeleton farm. So let's go out of here and I think that is everything to show you, I think. Yeah, that's everything to show. So. Now we can just start going to where the end portal is, which I haven't found yet. So hopefully it doesn't take too long. I do have everything. I've got eyes of enders. I've got cobblestone in case we need to pillow across. I've got the bed. I've got compass in case we... I don't know why I'm, I'm taking a compass. In case I need to come back here and I can't find it, I guess. I don't know. I have power four and break and free. Punch one infinity bow. I've got an arrow. So touch pickaxe to pick up my ender chest. I've got my sword, I've got my armor, which is all good. Um, I've got more blaze rods, more ender pearls, glass bottles for dragon's breath. I've got a grindstone in case I need that, which I don't think I will. I have a respawn anchor, which I will show you guys how to make as well. This is just, um, Six obsidian, uh, crying obsidian. So three crying obsidian on the top, three on the bottom, and then three glowstone uh, along the middle. We have tw 15 bookshelves, the enchanting table. We've got lapis. We've got spare torches. 
crafting table, books, and a furnace. So I think we have everything that we need. I think. If we don't, it's too late now. Um, Isabella, can you fire, please? Why won't they fire? Oh god, there they go. Okay, it's this way. None of you pop, please. One of you popped. Okay. Well, let's over this way by Cass's place. So let's go by Cass's place. Oh, we've changed direction. We're now over this way. We're no longer just straight. Oh, it popped. So we're now going this way. Really? Guess we're gonna make some more. Eyes of Ender. Oh! That also means that we are down some because we now don't have 12, we only have 11. I was sure I put 12 and then kept the rest out. I only made one there. Okay, let's just make four. Hopefully the portal is filled in a bit. Hopefully. Or at least we run into Enderman somewhere or I find Eyes of Ender in a chest somewhere. I should also probably sleep so I don't get killed while I'm exploring. Oh my well, okay, I might need you. So I'm gonna sleep and carry on. If we change direction or anything, I will pop back in with you guys. Or if we find it, of course. <laughs> Oh, we've passed it, we've passed it. So it's somewhere here. And I'm currently getting shot at. So somewhere around here is the portal. That was straight after, like, this is where I ended, I just had the last clip, it was right here. Okay. Okay, see so this way now. Please don't say it's in this mountain. Okay, I'm gonna climb this top mountain and throw another one and see where that takes us. Okay, so that's taking us this. It's in the mountain. It's in the mountain. Yeah, it's going down now. So it's like here. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm just gonna. Zombie, do you mind? Please. I'm just gonna dig straight down, which I know isn't really you shouldn't do, but I have headphones on so I can hear lava. So, although I probably shouldn't dig straight down because there might be a cave. I probably shouldn't dig straight down because, because normally I'll dig straight down. Once I start here on lava, I'll stop. And then I'll start doing this way. but I don't have a spawn set and it's quite far out so I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to keep jumping down. Hopefully, oh, we found it. We found the strongholds. Okay. Oh God, that's a lot of zombies. That is a lot of zombies. Okay, I'm getting shot as well. Oh god, this is too many mobs. This is too many mobs. Uh, oh god, too many. I think I just heard the skeleton die, which is good. Oh god, how many of you is there? Oh, we got a shovel. <laughs> We only took half a heart of damage in that. Yeah, the skeleton got killed. We only took half a heart damage. Not too bad. Okay, I should probably be lighting up where I've been as well. Just so we know that we've been that way. Uh, door. Thank you. Hey, spider. I'm getting so much lag. 
Why am I getting so much lag? Okay, so there was down here that I haven't been yet because of the lava. So maybe it's down here, because I've pretty much explored the full stronghold and I can't find it. So maybe it's just down here. Because there's a doorway at the end of this hallway. There's also a chest as well. So what is in this? Iron pickaxe, three bread and an iron helmet. Okay, it's not really useful. Okay, so we've got a staircase going down. Portal room! Okay, so we have a uh, light you up. Are you kidding me? There is no eyes of Ender in the portal. There is none. None whatsoever. We don't have enough eyes of Ender. That is a joke. That is a complete joke. Ugh, if those two eyes didn't break, we would have had eyes of Ender. I'm gonna have to go off and find Enderman now. Okay, well I'm just gonna be back once I find some Enderman. And then we will get into the end and fight the dragon. Okay, so I found two more endermen and we have two more eyes of ender now. I mean two more ender pills. So now we can get this little and now we can go at the end. Okay, so we need to sort out our inventory because that is a complete mess. Do you know what we could do actually? Is in the end we could build I don't know stuff to pick that up there. Oh I do. We could build a chest where the respawn anchor is. Okay, so we are not above ground. Which is why I brought some stone. So that we can build one. And I realised I chucked out iron doors when I need doors for this. Oh, we could have used those iron doors. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Then a dragon never comes down here anyway, so we should be fine. Okay, so crafting table. Crafting table. Respawn anchor with glowstone. Um, and the chest, you will be coming back with us. Oh, I, I actually have some there. Okay, we have chest. Uh, Chester. Um, don't need blaze powder right now. I'll leave some food back here. I'll leave half of them. I'll leave the compass, that, the boot, a bit of cobblestone. I'll just take a stack with me. I will leave the glowstone. I will leave these building blocks, the paper, the record, the iron, armor, the shovel, the grindstone I'll bring with me just in case, gold I can leave, potato, baked potato I'm going to leave. Really I've got baked potatoes in here so I should just leave it in there. So we've got enchanting, we've got the books, we've got the grindstone. Okay, so let's put that there. Put the armor in there. A half, well, not really half, just do 12. And put it with dirt. I might just keep two stacks of cobble out. Paper I can put away, that I can put away, that I can put away. The record I can put away. The bed I can put away. The shovel I can put away. Okay, that is everything that we need. So let's. Go do this and fight the dragon. Oh god, the dragon's like above me. Oh, there's the dragon. Okay. One thing I forgot is a pumpkin. So we don't look at look at the Enderman. So we, as long as we don't look at the Enderman, we're fine. Oh, that's a bomb. 
a little bit higher. There we go. I can't really see. Hold on, I'm gonna have to up that because I can't see the pillars probably. It might also be my lights that I've got on as well as like in my face. Yeah, that's a bit bad and see more now. So it's just partly my light. <laughs> Oh god, element. Oh, that was super close. There we go. You have a crystal, I can see that. Come on. Yes, got it. I don't know how many pillars I've knocked out yet. No, I've knocked out now. Okay, so that one's still working. Uh, higher up. Yes! We also damaged the dragon a bit with that one. You over there still have one. Which also damaged the dragon a bit. This one here has one. Whatever you do, Enderman, do not walk in front of me and get angry. Does that hit the... Okay, that one still has one up there though. That was the dragon. No, that was actually the crystal, wasn't it? So does the dragon not have any now? Let me get some of dragon's breath. Oh god, I need to eat. Wait, is an enderman angry at me? I haven't looked at you. Wait, wait, come in. Come on then. There you go. Okay, got all the dragons pressed that we need. I, don't, I think I've got all the crystals. I don't think there's any more now. So now we can just focus on just the dragon. Uh, oh. I didn't mean to look at you. Ah, uh, ah, uh, there we go. I accidentally put my sword in my half hand. That would have been bad. Oh god, I might actually die to an enderman. Come on. Thank you for letting me eat. <laughs> Oh, dragon's flinging me across the room. Across the end. Go, go back on your podium. Go back on your podium. We're not doing too bad, actually. We've done quite a bit of damage already. I'm so bad at hitting the dragon when it's flying, though. Definitely looks like we have all of the crystals. You can land. I got the side. This would have been so much faster if I had sharpness on my sword or sort of any sharpness because I don't. <laughs> too bad it's like a third of the way there pretty much oh 
<laughs> Bit lag because it was saving there. Come back to the podium. Come to the podium. Oh god. That was nearly death. I need to eat. Come on. Nearly there. He's going back. Nope, I thought he was going back to the podium there. I didn't bring a piston to grab the egg! And we do have torches though, so hopefully the torch trick still works. I'm in the breath. Go back to your podium. Why can't I hit you? Why can't I hit you? There we go, last hit. We done it! <laughs> Bring the end. But we beat the end of the dragon! Which also means now that this uh, this series is actually finished, which is kinda sad. But the idea that I have for my next base is way better than the one that I've been doing. So we will definitely do better on the next series. Does this torch trick still work? Yes it does! So now we have the dragon egg! Yay! Okay. So I left my under chest in the place. Where was... Where did I come up? What side did I come up from? Up oh, here it is. Oh, I forgot to pick up my ender chest. Uh, that was. That could have been the void. Okay, so I need everything. Now I can just clear out all of this. Should I just leave my respawn anchor there? I don't know if I should just leave that there. Okay, I'm just going to grab the most important things and I might just leave the rest here. Okay. Although iron armor's not that important. Yeah, I'm just going to take that. The uh, ender chest. Can't forget the ender chest. So I think we're just going to see what enchantments we can get on the books now. Uh, there we go. So we'll just see what enchantments we can get and then we will end the video here. The next episode is going to be the start of our the new server, which there is like it's a lot like Orbanox, but it's different at the same time, which makes no sense. But what I mean is that you can have protection three. Mm. But has it? Oh, sharpness! I could have used it before. But yeah, it has spawner crates instead of you buying spawners. But you do seem to get spawner. You can get spawner crates quite easy. So I think that's going to be quite different because I've never really played a server where you don't really get to choose what spawners you get you just sort of get one but I have been playing a little bit just to get set up and already fortune 2 on a level 30 that was bad but already I've got a zombie spawner because I just went caving for a little bit just to get some stone for the base like just to mark out where like the area of the base and while I was mining, I found a skeleton, uh, not a skeleton, a zombie spawner. So I have a zombie spawner already, which is good. So we have a form of XP. But yeah, once 
next week you guys will see what I have planned and everything. So I'm not going to tell you just yet, but it's going to be an amazing base in a one... Something I've never built before. I've never built a massive base before. I've also never planned... up oh, level 20 now. I've also never planned... Like, um... Like, went into a creative world and just planned out what a base is going to look like. I just normally have it in my head. I don't like go in and build it, like pre-build it. But I've actually done that with this one. Okay, that's all that we're gonna get. But I've pre-built this one, so it's gonna be really good, and it's gonna like it looks amazing in the creative world. So I can't wait to like build it in that server and get it all. Like show you guys what I have planned. It's gonna be amazing. But all I'm gonna say, I'm gonna give you guys a hint. It does involve a sea temple, but not in the way you think it will. <laughs> and that probably makes no sense whatsoever right now. But when you see what I have planned, it will make sense. But that's what I'm telling you guys is it involves a sea temple. Kind of. And that's all I'm telling you. <laughs> you will just have to wait until next week because next week I might show you guys the creative world so you can see what my plan is for the base. But anyways, we've beat the Ender Dragon. The next thing is just going to be to get Elite Round stuff. So what I might do is now and then, is play this world more off camera and then just now and then just pop in and show you guys. Or I might just completely leave this world here, I'm not sure. Because I can't really download it and this server is getting really laggy now. So I think, sadly, it might be it for the series. Well, obviously it's it for the series because it's the finale, but for this world, it might be it. So I guess we're just gonna jump and watch the, the credits. <laughs> well, anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed this series. I've had a lot of fun with it. I thought, like when I was started off the series, I did have a bigger idea for my base and I kind of procrastinated and didn't do that. And then I just got to a point where I was just like, oh, I just want to fight the Ender Dragon. So I think I definitely took way too long to get my base started because I pretty much had everything. And then it was, oh, well, I don't really need a, like, I don't really need that because I understood this. So I kind of definitely did wait too long. So they, on this next server I'm playing, I'm definitely going to focus more on base and what I am exploring, trying to get the base built up and stuff. But I was going to record on Orbanox, but Orbanox had a bit of a problem where there's the lost the server files or something like that. But the server was having a bit of problems and then they were saying on Discord, the owner was saying that he was going to sell it because he just didn't have the time. But he's posted since then, posted saying that they're going to have to build that something's changed so that can bring the server back but they're going to have to like, rework the whole server from the bottom they posted that after I'd already found a new server so um, maybe we'll record on Ormlox in the future depending on what happens but right now that server's down because they're going to, they're going to have to rebuild the complete server so that's probably going to take quite a while. But this so that server I have played on a bit. And it seems quite good. And it's got a, quite a friendly community and stuff. So hopefully that server is going to be just as good as Orbanox. But the only thing is you can't buy spawners. But you can get spawner crate which is easy enough. Like the key seems to be easy enough. You can get a spawner crate key from the Fortin crates in they also do a event thing where they, like if you're on it well for me it, it was half 11 last night i don't know if it's the same time every night but they just if you're on the server at this certain time you get a, a gold crate key so it seems to be quite easy to get the crate keys but i'm looking they also have quests which you can get tokens from and with tokens you can also buy spawner crate keys so it seems super easy to get when I create keys and everything, so I'm super excited to be joining this to join the server and play on the server and record on this server. I hope you guys enjoy it as well. 
I think you guys would definitely enjoy the base because it's a lot different than what I normally build. Because normally, lately, I've been like sort of just building towns, but they end up not being tied together. Like, so I'm like, oh, I'll do the paths off, build everything first, and then the paths tie all together. But by the time I do that, then I'm just like, oh, I don't really like it because it's not all tied together and it's just sort of spread out everywhere. Which I think is what's happened with this server. It, well, this server, this world. It's because everything was spread out. I haven't enjoyed, like I haven't really felt, I haven't felt creative enough to be like, okay, let's just tie everything together. I've just sort of been like, okay, get the main builds done and then I'll just do it later. But then it's sort of been like, oh, I'll just do it later, I'll do it later. And I think that was partly why it's just because it's been a thing of, because it's just sort of spread out, it doesn't feel like a base it just feels like you're living in sort of like a spread out area if that makes any sense but yeah we did do but i would say we did quite a lot but we didn't really finish much builds so i guess we didn't really do much on this series so i'm so sorry that we didn't do more like we didn't do more on this series but next series I think what I'm going to do is do a starter base and then just go straight in and build in, like just work on the base. Obviously not every single episode is going to be working on the base because I know that's going to be boring. So some episodes will be off doing quests and, but yeah, most episodes are going to be building, like working on the base. But I am going to try not to do it all the time and make like so the videos are just boring because it's just, oh, let's do another episode of working on the base. We will be doing other stuff. So I hope you guys are excited about that. And I can't wait for you guys to see what the base is that I'm going to do. There is the base that I'm going to do. There was different inspiration from it. One of them was green, which again, doesn't really give you guys much of a hint because green has done so many different builds. And then the other ones was just going on Google and just looking at other people's like I like other other people's bases and then just picking out little ideas from them. So one part so there is like the side sections are greens, which when I say side sections, you guys you'll see what I mean when we when I show you guys the base, what I mean by that. Well, along the sea templates, like the the sort of where the um, like where the I don't know what to call them, like the two wings at the side, like the top of them. Green did an idea, and I'm going to tie that under the base. Which, if you've seen the video of greens, you might know what I'm going to do. But that's the only part I've took from. Is that the only part? I think that. I think there might, oh there's another thing as well that you guys will see but I ha did have to change it from him because it didn't really work for what I was doing. But the other ones was just going on Google Images and just finding base, like just looking at other people's bases. One of them, so two of them I did get more inspiration from than what I did greens. But you guys will see that when I can show you. So anyways, I'm going to leave this episode here and I'm just going to, we're just going to skip through the rest of the credits because I've explained everything that I need to explain. But um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video and series. <laughs> I think this might actually be the first series I've actually fully finished. Although we didn't build everything in the world, so I don't really know if you can call it finished. <laughs> but anyways I'm ending the series so I guess you kind of can but anyways I'm going to leave this episode here and series here so I hope you guys did enjoy this series and episode I hope you guys are, are excited about the new series and the new server and I will see you guys in the new series and server so anyways thank you guys so much for watching this episode and series Remember to leave a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't already so you can see the new series and new server. And yeah, I'll see you guys there. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next week. So bye guys.